Merle Haggard was one of the greatest country artists of all time, and he had some killer guitar pickers in his band through the years. Hi, my name is Mateus Canteri. I'm a professional musician here in Nashville, Tennessee. We're playing Hot Chicken Picking Licks is the only way to survive. And today we're going to go over uh, some of Merle Haggard's most iconic guitar solos. Make sure you guys watch until the end because I got a special surprise for you. This right here is a good example of how you don't need a whole lot to create a really cool solo. The whole thing is built over the G major pentatonic scale. <laughs> They say you can't write a country song unless you talk about mamas, trains, prison, and trucks. So this right here is as country as it gets. Time for some halftime fun. A lot of cool licks you can grab from this one. Now this is a Lefty Frizzell song that Merle recorded and made it even better than it was. Another simple solo that embellishes the main melody of the song. Roy Nichols played on several of Merle's biggest hits in the studio and he's one of those players that helped define the sound of country guitar. This is a killer chicken picking solo from a live performance where Roy put all the cool licks in the right place. Uh, if you want to learn the intro to this song, make sure you check out my other video on my top 10 country guitar intros of all time. I told you I had a surprise for you, so here's a solo that I wrote over Stay Here and Drink for a student of mine a while back. Uh, we were talking about uh, using major and minor pentatonics and mixolydians, so it has a little bit of all of those things that I just said. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you click like, subscribe, uh, share it with your friends, ring that bell, uh, and let me know in the comments what's your favorite Merle Haggard song to play or listen to. Thank you, and I'll see you next time.